I thought a great message today would be the power of focus. And what I'd like to do is I'd like to glean some wisdom from some uh, experts, some you know celebrities, authors, thought leaders. And so I, I pulled seven powerful quotes that I think we can use to learn from in order to um, really dial in on focus. And focus, I love the acronym for focus. Focus is follow one course until successful. As entrepreneurs, business leaders, individuals, I think a lot of times we've got that shiny object syndrome and we're always looking at the next, next best thing or trying to catch the next wave when, you know, it really doesn't matter what you do. You could be selling yo-yos and the bottom line is if you are focused and you follow one course until successful, you know, what the mind of man can conceive and believe it can achieve absolutely with focus. So let me go ahead and go through these seven quotes, give you a couple of ideas and some, some strategies that you can use. The first one is by George Lucas. Many of you know him as a billionaire genius behind the, the Star Wars franchise. And if you really think about the Star Wars franchise and what it's done recently, you'll see that time, just like a diamond, time under pressure eventually turns into something amazing. And it, and it has been. Um, I'm not going to get into the story, but his quote is, always remember your focus determines your reality. Remember that your focus does re determine your reality because what you focus on grows. What you focus on will become your life. Your thoughts are your life and they do create your life. And so what you focus on, whether it's directly or indirectly, some of you think, well, I'm not spending a lot of time on personal de development. Let me tell you something. Your life is being shaped by your thoughts and what you focus on now. Some of you are focused on your bills. You're focused on your problems. And by default, your life is being shaped for you. So remember what you focus on will determine your reality. The second quote is by LL Cool J. Uh, some of you might surprise some of you, but, and he says, stay focused, go after your dreams, and keep moving forward towards your goals. And the reason I love that quote is because, look, some of us set these huge, huge goals, and when, when we can't, when we don't look like we're going to accomplish them, we sort of back off. And the bottom line is this, I suggest that you have huge goals and you dream big, but you break them into smaller goals and small milestones. Because remember, the key is to stay on course. Follow one course until successful. It doesn't say, you know, you're going to make it or not make it. You know, stay focused and keep moving the goal towards your goals. And so that's the second powerful quote I wanted to give you. The third one is by a guy named David Donat Donatarius. Donatarius, sorry, I almost messed that up. Um, and his quote is this, our focus is our future and what we focus on will multiply in our lives. Now, many of you have heard this. Many of you have heard Brandon and I both, uh, as well as Donovan and others, talk about it. What you focus on grows. Bottom line, what you focus on grows, and what you focus on will multiply in your life. And, and some of you are so caught up in how you're going to make it happen, and you don't realize it's not up to you to make it happen. It's just up to you to focus. Focus on the goal. Focus on the goal and it'll multiply. But you also need to visualize your life because what you focus on will multiply. And if you visualize and crystallize in your mind what you're trying to accomplish, you will make it a, a reality. You will make it a reality, but only with focus and determination. The fourth quote that I have for you is by none other than Napoleon Hill. And he says, focus on the possibilities for success, not on the potential for failure. Now, it's interesting because I had a, a gentleman uh, that I had a discussion with at a, at a business meeting we had last night. And, you know, he said, look, I've been doing this for a while. And, you know, people sort of, you know, I've had failures and people see this and that. And I can't really convince them that, you know, uh, and he was trying to think of the positive, but it's a subtle difference. He said, I can't really help them to understand because they see my past. Here's the bottom line. He was focused on what wasn't working. He was focused on the obstacles he thought he was going to have. And here's the deal. Be careful what you focus on because you're going to get more of it. Many of us focus on the past. Many of us focus on disaster. Many of us focus on the obstacles and you're going to get more of that. The bottom line is Napoleon Hill says, focus on the possibilities. When you're looking at things, are you looking at the opportunity or are you looking at the cost? Are you looking at your return on investment? Or are you looking at the expense? Look at the possibility and stay focused on the possibility. Put your eyesight on the possibility. Next quote is by Socrates. This is the fifth quote. And it says, the secret of change is to focus all of your energy, not on fighting the old, but on building the new. See, some of us focus on our weaknesses instead of our strengths. Some of us focus on what happened in the past. Now, listen, if what happened in the past isn't 
giving you a lesson to learn and grow from in the future, then it's just drama. It's just brain damage. Stop focusing on the past unless it's to help you grow and move forward into the future. Look, everybody makes mistakes. All of us have had failures. All of us have had problems. But you've got to forget about the past and you've got to be focused on the possibility. And here's the beautiful thing. Every day is a new day. Today is a brand new day. That's why we get this gift every single day to start over. You know, you've got to focus on the possibilities and stop fighting the old and build on the new. The next uh, quote is by Venus Williams. What a superstar. Venus Williams, huge, huge, huge goals. Her quote is, I don't focus on what I'm up against. I focus on my goals and I try to ignore the rest. Can you imagine if you have these big goals set and every time you get hit or every time you see a distraction, you take your eye off the ball just for a second because it's only minor differences, minor things that make the difference between success and failure. So Venus talks about how ignore the rest, just focus on your goal, set big goals. That'll create big results. And that leads me right to the last quote. And the last quote is by Bruce Lee. And this quote is, the successful warrior is the average man with laser-like focus. Laser-like focus. That's where I, I said before, you know, focus on one course until successful. What separates good from great is focus. What separates the amazing from the average is focus. Now, I actually have a bonus quote here for you. The bonus quote is by, it's actually in Proverbs 4.25. And it says, let your eyes look forward, let your eyes look directly forward and your gaze be straight before you. Let your eyes look directly forward and your gaze be straight before you. And I think that that's an amazing way to end this, this message because I think the bottom line is this. As long as you're looking forward, as long as you're looking to the future, as long as you're looking to your vision, you're executing in the now and you put your blinders on and you don't worry about everything else going on around you. You know, uh, Brandon and I were talking about, Joel Olstein said uh, the other day in his, in his uh, podcast, in his sermon, he says, you know, you're going to outperform. You're going to outlast people, but you have to be focused on your goal. It'll take you through what you need. And so here's the thing I, I encourage you to do. Tap into the power of focus. There's a power inside focus. It's not just about staying on track. When you are focused, you're going to have the energy. When you are focused on your goal, you're going to be motivated. When you're focused on where you're going, you're going to be inspired. If you'll stay focused, don't lose your focus. You're going to be successful. I absolutely believe you've got the ability to do what you want in your life. You can absolutely accomplish what you need. And it's never too late to start living the life that you were meant to live. That's my message for today. I'm a 